Yeah, I, I really appreciate that so much. You don't know what it means to me. Thank you very much. I appreciate applause. I can, I can never milk the applause behind the curtain. You know, these people will do that. They'll keep you clapping for 10, 15 minutes. I, I've worked with people like that. I don't know how they do it. They stand behind the curtain and they, and they just go, oh, oh. <laughs> And it's kind of an abuse, right? Because they're kind of getting off on it. They go, oh. oh. I would never do that to an audience. I, uh... And besides, the times I've been disappointed, I come back out, I thought they're still clapping. It was all the seats going up I could hear. That was, you know... <laughs> Yeah, rock concerts are the worst ones for the encore. They'll keep you clapping for 15 minutes when you're out there. You're flagged anyway. You've been standing all evening. Oh, do come back. Please come back and play the three hits we actually fucking remember from your repertoire. <laughs> well, listen, uh, I've got my phone here and we've had some texts coming in, I've been told, so uh, thank you for those. And uh, I'm just going to read from the top. If yours isn't read out, don't worry, it's just that it was rubbish. <laughs> so uh, let's go from the very top. We've got your number, Stumpy. <laughs> Does Snow White know about your other job? Jack, this gig must seem easy work to you after taking that ring all the way to Mordor. <laughs> I'm getting the gist of this now. I, yeah. Jack, I live on Peabody, work in B&Q and come from Birmingham. <laughs> I'll see you outside after. Jack, have you ever laughed so hard a little bit of wee has come out? <laughs> no, I haven't. <laughs> Although I did once shit myself coughing at a funeral. <laughs> that counts, I don't know. <laughs> Irishman goes for a job at a blacksmith's. Have you any experience at shoeing horses? No, says the Irishman, but I once told a donkey to fuck off. <laughs> Jack, did you hear about the dyslexic pimp? He bought a warehouse. <laughs> if your phone is in Greek, how the hell can you read this? Hello, Jack. How much does a cockney spend on shampoo? Pan 10. <laughs> it's my birthday. Sing happy birthday to me, please, Jack. Thank you, Rachel. Where are you, Rachel? Yeah, you want me to sing happy birthday? Yeah. You must be kidding. <laughs> How old are you? You don't have to clap, just wave your asbo. I can see you. <laughs> She's doing this to me. She's... You're all right. Not too much. You're sweating badly. <laughs> what did you want to say? What did you want to say? Did anyone hear what she said? Your name is Charlie. <laughs> You're smoking, Charlie. <laughs> yeah. Oh god. The other one's waving as well now. <laughs> I said, all right. Yes. What do you want? Semaphore now. Hopefully that's that. <laughs> People like that, you can never tell, really. <laughs> yeah, you know, for them it's a night out. <laughs> for the carers, it's a night off. Jack, you have half suction on a vacuum cleaner for fabrics such as curtains and soft furnishings. <laughs> what do you call a man with no shins? Tony. <laughs> Jack. I've been banned from B&Q for life when one of their assistants asked me if I wanted decking and I broke his nose. <laughs> what key opens every lock? A pie key. 
My four-year-old son requires a suit for a wedding. I've been struggling to find one. Where did you get yours? <laughs> Ibuprofen is just as good as Nurofen and 50p cheaper. <laughs> and us pharmacists do five years training, so fuck you. <laughs> What do you call a French man in a Ferrari? Doesn't matter because we've got the Olympics and they haven't. <laughs> the blue whale ejaculates over 40 gallons of sperm when mating, but only 10% enters the female, and you wonder why the sea tastes so salty. <laughs> Hi, Jack. Stand still, I can't get a clear shot. <laughs> Carlos. Hello, Jack. I had a wet dream about you last night. I dreamt you got hit by a bus and I pissed myself. <laughs> Listen, you've been a great audience. Thank you very much.